I'm sorry Christians. I do respect the Constitution's freedom of religion. Yes, you have every right to believe what you want. If you pray in private or at church with like-minded people, I don't have a problem with it. When you try to spread misinformation that you cannot prove, I do have issues with it. It's not about what you believe, as much as how you think. For some reason you feel the need to block out reality and reason in order to believe in this Jesus figure. I see this as a way to distort reality, much like alcoholics or heroin addicts do. The only difference is that they do it with chemicals and you do it with self-imposed ignorance. I'd like to know why so many people go through such measures to distort reality. If reality is so bad, why live at all? To me, reality is nature and just because it's not all good, doesn't mean I have to pretend it is. As somebody who cares, I am concerned about you, much the way I'd be concerned about others who distort reality through chemicals. Living a lie isn't healthy, even if it makes you feel good. It's destructive in many ways. Believe what you want, but you're fooling yourself, not me. I really hope you open your mind and embrace reality. The real truth will set you free. The living God that you serve is nothing but a way to distort the truth to your liking. Think about it.